<laughs> and uh, he was. He was big when he was born. <laughs> and uh, I've known Chris basically since he got to Memphis, and he was big too. <laughs> so, and he still is. So, uh, I'd just like to say that the project you guys are going to witness tonight and listen to has been just a labor of love. I know Boo and I have talked about this often, sitting at the studio by ourselves and trying to get this thing together and with Chris, and it's just been, it's really been an incredible project. Unfortunately, it's taken the back seat, and I'm not dropping names on Boo, but I am. Uh, this project took about a year longer than it should have because Boo was doing, let me see, Bruno Mars, uh, Boss Gags, Take Me to the River soundtrack with Bobby Rush and Bobby Blue Bland and Otis Clay and William Bell and, oh, don't want to forget Snoop. And, uh, but he's been busy. But we finally got this thing finished and we had it delivered at 7 o'clock tonight. We got brought up. And it just makes me very proud to be standing here with Boo, who, by the way, I'm his Uncle Jerry, in case you didn't know. And with Chris, two finer guys you cannot be affiliated or associated with. And I just want to tell you, there's a couple other people that need mentioning, and I, I'm going to take the liberty to mention. Sharon, will you stand up, please, or come up here. Stand up, Sharon. Okay. Whatever. You know. You're going to be the diva. Okay. But, and Cindy, there's just so many, and the thrillers at the grill. Yeah. Most yeah. of y'all are here. Um, it's incredible how y'all have backed this thing and stayed behind these guys under probably 20 different band names. Uh, one week there's something, and next week there's something else, and y'all are still there cheering. So we appreciate that. Uh, let me introduce Boo Mitchell. Lawrence Boo Mitchell, officially. And by the way, Vaughn and Lowe Mitchell are out there. Willie Mitchell's daughters. Please wave Vaughn and Lowe. There you go. There's Anna. And Daniel. And Ethan, he's over. My favorite little great nephew's over there somewhere shooting pool, probably. Uh, but I do want to thank y'all. Neil Harkby for letting these guys rehearse. Jill for letting them come to your house and rehearse this album. David Fleischman's out there somewhere. His better half, Jay. My better half, my son, was back there, I think, with Mike and Millie Young. But anyway, thank y'all very, very much for coming out tonight. We're going to get this thing cranking now. Boo, can you just say a 102 more? Y'all give it up for Uncle Jerry. Yeah! He's one of the greatest guys I know. And if, if I'd have known he was going to wear the Chuck Taylors, I would have finished this record six months ago. <laughs> yeah, but this project has been uh, so awesome and so much magic that comes from all of these guys. I've, you know, uh, known, known them or known of them, you know, all my life. And uh, to be able to work with them has been just a pleasure and, and a privilege. Um, the first time we went in the studio, I think we were there for a couple of two days or three days or something. And then I got right on another project and about four months later, I pulled up the stuff and listened to it. Me and Jerry looked at each other and we were like, holy sh crap. <laughs> it was so, um, it, it was just so awesome and, and inspiring. So I, I really, it, it, I'm honored and pleasure to have worked on it, especially with Jerry and Chris, my Uncle Jerry. So I'm going to introduce you guys to, you already know Double K, the man that's trying to keep the Memphis music alive, holding it together. Yeah. Chris Porter does. Thank you. I'm just happy to be a part of this and uh, part of anything to do with live music in Memphis. I think it's wonderful. And I don't want to keep your time. I just want to thank everybody for coming. Good to have you all here. Thanks for coming out. And let me introduce Mr. George Klein to have him come on up and bring up the band to get things started. All right. Guys, this is something George never does. He doesn't drive much at night. But when we asked him if he wanted to come to, the, to this particular event, he said, what time and where, and I will be there. 
And that's an extreme rarity for him. I want you to know that we're honored to have him here tonight. Yeah. Man, all these nice things, I should have recorded that. <laughs> but it, it, Chris has a wonderful venue here, he and Sharon, and uh, uh, it, it's a great pleasure to be here with with, Jeff, with uh, Mr. Rowell, Mr. Jack Rowell. I know him under many great names. I'm going to interview, I'm gonna interview Jackie in the Guinness Book of Records. You've been with more bands. You had more bands, I think. You must have set a world record. I remember he was with Brute, the debut. And Jimmy James was with that and he changed. Every time he's on my television show, he's got a different name. <laughs> but anyway, this is called the Royal Blues Band. But seriously, it's good to be here uh, with Memphis people. And like Jerry said, he gave me a shout since I've known Jackie and all the guys, Bill Dollar, and Leo, and them guys backstage. Uh, you know, I, I didn't even say, well, I ain't gonna check my calendar. I'll be there. And I, and I came to see some good music in a good venue. It's a pleasure. Thank you for having me here, Leo and Jerry, Boo, everybody. Uh, Jack's going to do a, I have a TV show called Memphis Sounds with George Klein. Now it goes you know, all over the United States. If you live in outside America, Memphis, you check it out on YouTube. We're on every day. And Jackie's going to be on, Jack Rawls going to film the show uh, next November 7th. Be seen in December. But Jackie's been on the show under about 20 different names, I think. <laughs> but he, he's a great guy. I used to see him at the Horseshoe Casino all the time. And this Boo Mitchell guy by here, what a legend. He took it where Pops took off. Pops Mitchell, Willie Mitchell, that is. And his family's here. We filmed a reality show over there. And we used Boo and some of the guys in the reality show. And uh, uh, Chris back here, he's even sharing in the reality show. He should be coming out with sometime next year. It's called Memphis Connection with George Klein. But anyway, these are all Memphis people. And there's one thing you can't beat. I'm sorry, Nashville. You can't beat Memphis music. I guarantee you that. You know. <laughs> I remember, I remember uh, one quick story. Chips Moman moved his group over. Chips was a great producer. Pretty suspicious minds on Elvis. Uh, Sweet Carolina Neil Diamond. I can go on, on and on. He went to Nashville. He took his band with him. And he cut over there. And he cut Waylon Jennings on Looking by Texas. And it was the first time in Nashville, Tennessee, that an album went platinum. And they were on stage had this big shindig. And he said, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, uh, Mr. Chips Moment, he cut our first platinum record here in Nashville. And Chips got him and said, well, thank you very much, but we're all from Memphis. <laughs> <laughs> but we're proud of it. And uh, this guy, Boo Mitchell, boy, he took up, he got that, uh, took up where his father left off, uh, Willie Mitchell, and uh, so many wonderful memories over at Royal Recording Studio. And Jerry over here used to manage Paul Revere and the Raiders and manage Flash back there. And uh, Mary Lee Rush, Angel of the Morning. And, uh, and Boo, Boo just, he just, the thing about Boo Mitchell is that he took up where Willie lived off and he ain't stopped, man. That movie, you gotta see that movie, Take Me to the River, it is fantastic. She probably won some kind of Academy Award, really, don't you think, Jerry? Should. It really is a great, great movie. So check it out. I don't want to talk anymore, but I'm gonna bring the guys up here now and let, we're gonna see some of this music. This, the album is called Royal Blues Band featuring Jackie Rowe Jr. And, uh, I'm going to try to name everybody in the group, but I know Bob is up here, Buddy Davis over there, and Bill, Bill Dollar, see him in Piccadilly all the time. Leo fixes my motorcycle for me. <laughs> I quit riding Leo when I was passed away. Jackie Rowell, Bill Dollar, Bill performing with Hank Williams Jr. on drums. That man can play some drums. Now, where's Mr. Ross, the boss? He's over there. And Bob, where's Bob at? Well, Bob's over there. So I got everybody to get a believe by Leo. <laughs> Buddy Davis, where's Buddy? He's, got the, oh, he's hiding over there, Buddy Davis. You think you're talking about something I got it, man? Check this out. Buddy Davis' sister is married to Fred Smith and owns Federal Express. <laughs> so if you ever need anything from Federal Express, just call Buddy Davis over there. <laughs> He'll take care of you. Seriously, it's good to be up here with a bunch of Memphis people in a Memphis place. And uh, there's some good songs on here. And Jackie Jones going to play everyone in Boo, is that right? And Boo, you produced it, didn't you? All right, with Royal Record. You got anything to do? Y'all enjoy. Rock on. Go Memphis! <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. As I said, Jackie, how many names have you had in bands you've been in? 20? No, more than that, man. 
But anyway, he's done my television show under different band names all the time. But we saw, he's always welcome. Anybody from Memphis is always welcome on my television show, Memphis South. But anyway, we're out of here, ladies and gentlemen. Let's hear it for our Memphis Bound Memphis music. I love Memphis music. Royal Blues Band, featuring Mr. Jackie Rowell.